kind of dark outside. <gasps> oh, this thing is huge. Coco, get off. <laughs> oh, baby, this box is huge. Are you guys ready? It's gonna be fun. Oh, man. Oh, I'm super excited. Finally, a gaming chair. By the way, I got it from Secret Lab. I purchased it myself with my own money. I am not sponsored. I got the soft weave, cookies, and cream, baby. This is the brand new um, gaming chair that they've just released. It's not the leather one. It's not the PU leather. This is soft weave. So it's very breathable, very comfortable, and you won't sweat when you're on it. And I had to pay a little extra for it. I think it was like 30 bucks more. But I'm pretty sure it's gonna be worth it. We're gonna be unboxing it with my brother. Say hello to my brother. That's that's not my brother. Anyways, so let's let's, let's get this thing open. It has a I think it has a two-year warranty to it. But I'm pretty sure it'll last me way longer than two years. Oh, come close, come close, come close. You ready for this? Ooh. Do not touch. Oh, it smells like a brand new car. Wait, 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 give, me, give me that. Oh, it's in the instruction manual. Well, this is a big ass assembly instruction manual. Oh, so leave her right here. Coco, won't get mad at me. Put it on top of your bed. Come close, come close, come close. Oh my goodness. Ooh. That looks like a car Dude, seat. I was looking at DX racers, but DX racers are ass. I've, I've seen a lot of honest reviews, and they're just saying they're good because they're sponsored. But there's actually some dude that actually did a review on DX Racers and purchased it with his own money and he was super pissed how terrible their customer service was, how the product wasn't like premium and it was just a bad company. We'll see with my honest review if it's actually worth purchasing a Secret Lab gaming chair. Wow! Wow, dude! Smells like a brand new car! Oh. As stitching everywhere. Omega right over there, it's in black. Secret Lab on top, it has a logo right here. God of War. <laughs> Good texture, like that. Put that right there. So next we have here, ooh, this is soft. This is the lumbar support for your back, for your lower back, upper back, wherever you want to put it. Usually it's like in the middle. Oh. This is memory foam. Yo, feel this, feel this. This is soft. Whoa. All right, thanks for my new my backpack. Yo, this is noise. Oh, the pillow's not um, memory foam. It's just like a pillow. It has like cotton in there. Still feels pretty good. Here. You see the lumbar? You can ass. put it on my bed. What the hell is this? Yeah. <sighs> Ooh, imagine that. Ooh. You give me the head, give me the head, give me the head. Oh yes! Perfect for gaming! <laughs> but yeah, look, 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 over here. Come to my bed. So the lumbar support actually goes like right here. You kind of just place it there and it just sticks on there when you put your back on it. And the pillow, it's stretchy. It's a strap that you just put around the chair. And there it is. That's what it's gonna look like. Are you sure that's the right way? Yeah, that's either way. Why is the Omega like facing there? Yeah, I know it's like that, because oh. like the back. This is well packaged by the way, guys. Look at that. Oh! It's stuck out. It's fine. It's not damaged or anything. I'm Siver from League of Legends. <laughs> it's a shiny black paint to it. Not bad. Nice. That's gonna be our base. We have here, oh look at that, even more foam. Yo. Secret Lab got it protected, baby. Oh, this must be it. This must be the chair where you put your ass on it. Holy crap. Woo! Yo, this is nice! It's like some type of soft plastic. This is gonna last a long time. It's not, it's not um, leather or anything but it's cushiony and it's soft and smooth. Wow, there's tape. How do you get this thing off? Oh, dude. Ooh, there it is. 
do not remove this strap until backrest has been securely installed. There's a the metal plate back here. I'm pretty sure we're gonna probably attach this to the, the, the base. The bolts are really tight. Everything's nice and flush. They use rings to keep all the fabric together. What is this? Is a shoe box? Accessories box six centimeters. Oh, we got some Nike shoes. What the hell is this? Is that ear pods? What ear pods? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. They're lever lever handles. They look like ear pods. Um, casters wheels, hydraulic piston, and two side covers. Oh, so basically this is how to clean and take care of your uh, your chair. Let me get a little close up. Oh, we got here today some macaroons, some cookies and cream macaroons. Nice. And these are probably the the covers for the side of the chair. There's two of them. Yep. All right. Hey, where's the earpods? The earpods. There's the earpods. Whoa. <laughs> they don't look. You ready? You ready for the earpods? <laughs> <laughs> Jamming out with the earpods. It looks like a golf club. Oh, and then here's the bolts. Oh, Allen, Allen key. Oh, everything's already given to you, so you don't really need anything. Everything's already given to you. And then here's the piston. By the way, my parents have no idea what it is, so once we assemble this, my brother and I are gonna show them, and they're gonna sit on it, and they're gonna give an honest review as well. We're not gonna tell them how much it costs, because then they're gonna be mind blown, and then they're gonna be biased about it. So we're gonna th make them use my, show them right there. That's my Ikea chair right there. That was like 60 bucks. And then this gaming chair was 300 bucks. <laughs> yeah, I know, it's expensive, but my paycheck came in, it's winter break, and I was like, you know what, I've always wanted a gaming chair for my gaming setup, and fuck it, you know what, fuck it. All right, let's assemble this bad boy. On this thing, what are you doing? What are you doing? Control. Really easy to assemble. Boom, easy. Ta-da! Ooh, it's a big black piece. Looks like a cover for it. Just put it in the hole. Nice. <laughs> Sick. That's it. I gotta do this with all four sides, all two sides. There should be four of these. So if you push down, push down. Just a bit. There it is. And then. Right here, they actually gave us extra ones, I think. You know what? No, I I'm wrong. I think these are for the bottom. These are the ones that already they were already assembled in the chair. Just screw it on there, both sides and then the other side. So the next step is to cover this thing right over here so it doesn't look all ugly and gave us this plastic cover and a bolt here. So using a Phillip, just screw this in there. Boom. It's just one screw. Not too tight, not too tight. I don't want to damage the, the fabric. Since we finally attached the backrest, it says I can finally remove this, this safety strap right here. Ooh. Okay, all right. We don't need that. Yay! Ooh, wow, this is actually really wide. Oh, here's the thing. The lever. Caution, do not adjust touch until backrest has been, has been installed. Okay. Oh, I didn't see you there. Guys, I took a break, I changed my shirt, it was freaking hot, and uh, I wanted to pet my doggie. Damn it, Coco. I was doing some research on YouTube right over here. I wasn't exactly sure how to attach this multi mechanism on there because it could go either way. It can go this way or it could go this way. So basically the, the hole should be facing where the green is to make it easier for y'all. Oh shoot. So basically when the washer is flattened out, that's when you know it's perfectly tightened. You don't have to go any tighter than that. There we go. Oh, that's it. Now we just gotta assemble. What the heck is this? <laughs> Coco! <laughs> the wheelbase. And then you just plug it in. How do we know if it's attached? Will it come off? God, this thing is heavy, guys, by the way. 
Coco, your toy! All right, guys, this is my first time ever sitting in a gaming chair. Will it actually feel different or will it just feel like in any ordinary chair? It's time to find out. It just like snaps and breaks on it. <laughs> Why'd you just leave all these back and forth? <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna adjust it right here. Sorry, guys, it's a little messy. I just really wanted to sit on it. I didn't want to clean it up. So. Oh, okay. Wow. I feel like I'm I'm being hugged from behind. So these, oh, these buttons right here are adjustable. There's like three different adjustments. There's the button down here too, to adjust it wider. Oh, I like that. It's wider. Oh, right here, right here. You can go up and down. Look at that. Oh. Alright, okay. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Yo, I think this is worth. Guys. This is nice. Yo, Ima, you gotta try this. Sit down, Joe, sit down. Try it, sit down, sit down. <laughs> How's it feel? Hello? <laughs> Yo, that looks nice too. Yo, that feels comfy, guys. Guys, it's, it's like a bucket seat, right? But bucket seats are usually not. On... <laughs> Can you go all the way? I think that's it. That's the farthest. You can't go any further than that. Yeah, compared to like DX racers or other gaming chairs, this thing doesn't go all the way back. But I don't think you need to do that anyways. If you want to... Can you stop? Coco, you're scaring Coco, dude. Look, see? Sit down on this chair to, to, to feel the difference. Okay, so that's the Ikea chair. It's like 60 bucks. All right. And this is leather, by the way. So I'm sick and tired of sweating my balls off on this thing when I play long gameplays and editing. So I needed a chair that made me feel a little more comfortable when sitting down. <laughs> yo, yo, hey, you can go all the way down. Yeah, you can. I can. Yeah, I didn't know. I, I just figured it out. Go, go, try it, try it. You're not gonna fall. There's Coco's pillows right there. Whoa. <laughs> There, there we go. That's what it looks like when it's fully reclined. You like it? Comfy? Yeah. Better than that chair? Better than my bed. What's that? It's a chair. For what? For my computer. What? You can go all the way back. Oh, you want to sleep here also? <laughs> See if you can tell the difference. That's my other chair. That's Ikea. Oh, this one is leather. Oh, this one is okay also. Oh, look, oh. oh, it's okay. 
Great guys, I just spent an extra how much for it. <laughs> Should have stuck with this chair. Oh, this one is good there. Yeah, but this one's more comfortable, right? Yeah, that one's com more comfortable. Okay, okay. All right, so I wasn't wrong with one thing. <laughs> so my mom's here to test out the chair. Try it. It's so dark, what is this? The Omega chair. Uh -huh. Oh, that's to adjust right there. Lumbar it's support. It's not a massage. No. <laughs> it's not a massage chair. I need a massage chair. This is nothing. You like it? Oh, cool. It's nice. Cool. I like a massage chair. <laughs> that chair compared to the other chair, how, how does it feel? It is cool. Oh, it's more comfortable than one. That one? You like that one better? Yeah. yeah. This one is like short. Yeah. Like missing something. Wait, wait, you got one more thing. So, oh, cool. <laughs> when you're lazy, that's it. Good. <laughs> nice. You want to sleep? Oh, okay. Can I bring this to my work? <laughs> no. Oh, man, I'm just really happy. Oh, my God, I finally get a gaming chair. <laughs> and I'm very satisfied. I'm super happy about it. The Omega, I think, is like the sweet spot. It's like perfect, perfect height. Perfect price, perfect size. Just, yeah, the price is a little expensive, I can say, but I'm pretty sure every good gaming chair out there is expensive, so if you have the money, go for it. Purchase it now. It's gonna be worth, especially since, what are you gonna be doing when you play games most of the time? Sitting down, right? So why not invest in something that it's gonna benefit you? And that's why I purchased this chair. And. Oh man, I'm falling in love with it. Uh, I hope this review actually uh, helped you guys determine whether to get a gaming chair. It doesn't have to be Secret Lab, but man, I made the right choice. That's all I can say. And I hope you guys do too. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh.